My name's Jeff. My name's Chris. My name's Chris. <laughs> Are we live? And uh, welcome to episode 14 of the Ultra RC Hobby Show. Yeah. Today, we're going to talk about Chris's new to him X01 that he already broke. I already broke it. Yeah. Don't hit things. Don't hit things. Mock chicken, it's I've been told. Uh, Chris also challenged me to a race. Yeah. I don't know what we're gonna do in said race, but last time we raced, I lost, and I don't take losing well. No, he doesn't. Um, so that kind of sucked. So hopefully we can redeem our. I didn't cry. Just a little. Well, one tier doesn't count. Oh, it counts. And that's after you, like. Yeah, that's what I thought. Be mean. You know, mean all the time. But yeah, let's get into all the awesome, action-packed episode 14. <laughs> Well, we're gonna quickly go through Chris's new to him X01. Yes. He's gonna show you the damage so he can uh, fix it up. But you'll probably see this in some future episodes of the Ultra RC Hobby Show. Yes. Uh, I know you've been pretty excited. I've got the need for speed. I hope so. Yes. So if, if anyone doesn't know, this is the Traxxas X01, uh, the 100 mile an hour supercar from Traxxas, uh, capable of 6S lipos, so two 3S lipos on either side. Uh, and what was it geared to when you got it? Like, it had a 34 tooth mod one pinion, so the pinion was about this big around. Yeah, it, it had a little bit of cog on the bottom end because it was overgeared. Yes. So if you're not sure what cogging and overgearing is, maybe you should check out episode, what was that, 12 or 11? Yes. How to choose your gearing on your pinions. Maybe you should check that out first and understand what we're talking about. But, you know, let's take the body up. Let's see what's inside yeah. this piece. So first of all, let's look at the bottom. So Draxxus keep the whole bottom nice and sealed up. So lots of airflow. We've got one hole for the air duct for the motor. Which is right here. Oh, right there. Yes. So we've got our air duct here. We've got slick tires on here. It's a radial tire, so it's not going to balloon like your normal tire. So radial meaning belted. Correct? Exactly. It's okay. belted tire. Yeah. This does share a lot of parts to the slash. It, it does. Right? Yeah, like the shock bit. towers are the same as the slash. Camberlinks are the same. Same front and rear knuckles. Nope, they are different. Forms. Are they different? Huh? Yeah, because they're on a six mil axle. Right. It's a six mil bearing. Gotcha. I just got bearings for it today. Yeah. Okay, so give us a rundown here, buddy. What do we got? Yeah, so this comes with the big bore shocks. Uh, it's a four wheel drive platform, so you've got all the traction on the ground. Uh, Castle eight scale system, Mama Monster 2. I believe this is a 2650, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, I'm running it on this, a Spectrum receiver, so I get really nice, clear uh, reception from that. And uh, I've actually smashed it once or twice now. I've bent the front uh, CV axle down here. So that's all wonky. I bent the front links. I broke a rear link the other day. I smashed the body. So it's definitely been through a little bit already. You're not easy on a bit. No, I'm not. But I guess this thing's probably a handful to drive yeah, at, is. you know, 60, 70 miles an yeah. hour. Like, you that's not even 100. That's just 60 or 70 miles an hour. You really have to pay hour. attention to what's going on. I bet. Where did you take it? I was just on the street in front of my house. You're brave. Yeah, I know. You're very brave. Only two cars. Only two. Only two. Only two. Uh, yeah, that's better than yeah. three. So I got some shocks to rebuild on this. We had a leaky shock when I got it. I'm also going to take it all apart and do brand new bearings and the whole thing. And we're going to paint up a new body for it too. I think you should probably clean it. I did clean it, but this it's still got this that haze on it. This isn't RC Deeb's clean yeah. approved. So kind of disappointed. It still needs to be shiny. It still needs to be shiny. So yeah, like we said, future episodes, you're probably going to see this a couple times. Uh, we're doing some speed runs and some testing and some other cool, fun stuff with the X01. Mm -hmm. But yeah, let's uh, let's get right into the racing. Is it race time? It is race day. <sighs> race day. What are we racing today? I don't know. You tell me. We got some Tamias to race. You're today. the one with all the cars. So we're gonna race the blue truck from the the first race, and we're also gonna race the MF01 Suzuki Jimny. So that's four wheel drive. So that's gonna be interesting. So we're gonna get a rear wheel drive. Against a four wheel drive. As a four wheel drive. Well, someone's still so, gonna have an advantage. So technically though, the four wheel drive will turn less sharp. Exactly. Right? So it should in theory turn with less speed, but we'll be able to come in the corner faster. Exactly. This is gonna be interesting. Are we gonna do like best of two again? Like one well, drives one, one drives that. the other? Yeah, and I've also upgraded the, the truck with a ball differential now, so it's got a lot better traction. Yeah, I did notice it, uh, is a little bit squirrely. Yeah. Uh, Chuck can probably put that uh, episode in there where we smack, well, I smacked the door frame. Uh, it may have got a little bit rowdy. Yeah, that was rowdy. Yeah. But yeah, let's get it racing. Let's get racing.
Oh yes, this is round number two of the Chris Debert and me race. The unfair racing series. Yeah, yeah. So I get the four-wheel drive uh, to me a Jimmy. And what are you running? I'm driving the Midnight Pumpkin, the Little Ride Pumpkin. They both have sport tune motors, so they both should be around the same speed. They have the same power plant. I may have changed one's two-wheel the drive one the Jimmy, drive. so yeah, the Jimmy is four-wheel drive, so it's gonna handle much better than the truck. Yeah, so we're gonna time it. So pretty much the Jimny, whoever's driving the Jimny, which is me this round, mm -hmm. is gonna set pace. How many ever laps they can do in, however long yeah. it takes them to do five laps, we're gonna compare that to how long it takes the other person with the, the Midnight Pumpkin to, to get around the track. So if you're really good at driving the fast one, you could really hurt somebody. Yeah. But if you're really bad and the other person's good, it could work out good. So we'll time it and we'll see what it takes. I feel like you are in for a world of hurt. I uh, probably will be. And then next round, it's gonna suck. Yeah, I can't wait to lose. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's do it. Okay, so I did five laps in 56 seconds and 0.86. Okay. I'm just coming around for my last corner of the fifth lap. Okay, so how many laps did you do? You did five laps. Why well, wasn't timing that? Slightly longer than Aaron. So you did three laps? I did five laps. Okay. So maybe the race should be whoever has a Jimny has to do five and whoever gets a truck has to do three. Ooh. Yeah, that might be good. Okay, well let's yeah, try that. We so that. I kicked his butt, obviously, because he's a far better driver. Yeah, much. <laughs> Sorry, I cheated. Okay, so let's do that. Yeah. So round two, Jimny has to do five laps, Toyota has or Ford has to do three. Yes. But you have to call your laps. So one, yeah. two, three, four, five. But you have to complete your fifth, so really you do one, two, three, you do six. Are you good? You have to cross the line for your six, six laps, laps to complete five. Oh, and the gym, yeah. Yeah, and the gym, but you just have to do three. Yeah. Okay. Okay, well let's do it for round two. Three, two, one, go. Now it's time to switch. So I get to do three complete laps in the little blue Ford, and Chris gets to do five complete laps in the Jimmy. So this is this is make or break. This is make make or break. I'm a block.
so since we both tied, yeah. Chris won his round, I won my round, it's gonna come down to a tiebreaker. So whoever can do five laps fastest with the Jimmy, yeah. it's gonna be a time trial. Whoever does that fastest is actually gonna take home the crown of Unfair Racing Series <laughs> round number two. Yeah. So, well, Chris is up first. Uh, let's see what uh, time he can baseline here. Uh, hey, so you get five laps, buddy. Good, make, make them I'm count. Ready. No crashing. I'm ready. One, go! One down. Oh, that's not fast! The first is not fast! Two down. Get into his face. Three down. Oh. Four laps. And that's five. Time. So Chris's time was pretty okay. Oh, 41.63? 41.63, so pretty not bad. So 41.63? 4163. Okay, so you get to work the stopwatch. Oh, oh, oh holy leck. Yeah. Holy dinosaur, eh? Holy dinosaurs. Okay, so I guess it's my turn now. Are you ready? No, I'm not. Be, That's a good time. Make that time. It's a good time. 41.63. You did you hit that like four I times. Just scrubbed it. Yeah, so I gotta be 41.63 yeah. in five laughs. This is gonna be interesting. This is a my car, so I'm just oh, gonna make excuses now. Oh, here we go. Now. <laughs> so I don't get time to drive. I don't get time to drive. I'm just gonna make excuses now. Like my finger, I drove too much this weekend. Yeah, no, it's sore. Finger, the trigger so finger. Oh. Yeah, like, I don't know what's going on. So I guess let's just get this over. Because if I lose, I don't know. But if I ever hear the end of it. <laughs> New mark. Get set. Go. Can I take a spin, boys? He's driving better than me. Oh, I, I spoke too soon. Reverse, Chuck, reverse. Your other reverse. There you go. They just do what I do, full throttle or nothing. Not your cars, so why not? Jumps and I get to sit here and watch. We're gonna watch Jimmy in his face. Well, that was the end 
ending. That's, that's, that's the ending. ending. Episode, episode 14. 14. 14. Oh, 14. Oh, dang. I called it 13. Right Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on YouTube. And like and share on Facebook. He gets to do the whole accent because I suck and lost. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. We still love you. Somebody does. Yeah, I know, right? Thanks for watching. <laughs> Ha 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 ha.